Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Arcasyc. In this video I'm going to talk about mindfulness and show you 6 simple exercises to be more mindful in your daily life. In the modern digital world everything is changing rapidly and we are overloading ourselves more and more with masses of information and sensations on a daily basis. We are not really present while doing what we are doing and time is flying by. At the end of the day, we maybe realize that we have been everywhere internally but in the here and now. Since the term mindfulness has become something like a trending term, let's take a look at the definition and benefits of mindfulness. Some describe it as paying attention in a particular way, on purpose, in the present moment and non-judgmentally, and as bringing one's complete attention to the present experience on a moment-to-moment -moment basis. What might sound a bit abstract is actually quite simple. Mindfulness is being in the here and now with our thoughts, feelings and body sensations. Although based on Eastern meditation, mindfulness is used in psychotherapy as a means to reduce stress, depression and anxiety. Studies indicate that practicing mindfulness has positive effects on self-esteem and overall life satisfaction. Positive effects can already be experienced immediately after only one exercise. Before we dive into the mindfulness exercises, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button to help my channel grow and never miss out a new video. Let's start with my favorite one, conscious eating. I love eating, but on stressful days I tend to eat quickly in order to go on with my work. So every time I catch myself in eating quickly, I remind myself and try to eat very consciously and to actually enjoy the food I'm eating. At your next meal, try to eat very slowly and to savor every single bite. Turn off your TV and smartphone. Eating is a need, but enjoying is an art. Enjoying is not something you can do on the side. Enjoying needs time and will slow you down so you can actually enjoy what you are eating, uh, I mean doing. Number 2. Mindful walking. Nature offers our brain stimuli, which it has known since our evolutionary existence. Our brains are not made for the sheer mass of images from the TV, the smartphone or the computer in the long term. It has difficulty evaluating and filtering all of this. In nature there are few stimuli in comparison. So spending time outdoors in the green not only has a calming effect on our minds but also has a positive effect on our blood pressure, heart rate and breathing. So try to take a walk outside without any music and walk very consciously. You will notice that there is something meditative about walking steadily in itself. Number 3. Conscious breathing. The way you breathe influences your psyche and vice versa. Pay attention to your breathing. Do you tend to take long and deep or short and fast breaths? Short and rushed breaths are often caused by stress. Short breaths prevent enough oxygen from reaching your body and can lead to many health problems. Long and deep breaths on the other hand can prevent stress and provide relaxation. Try my guided box breathing exercise for a more steady and regular breathing. It only takes 4 minutes. Number 4. Pausing. In case you would like to pause completely at a point in your day, maybe when you feel like everything's becoming too much for you, then try to step out completely for a short time. This also works at the workplace in a relatively calm environment and even on the toilet. Spend a few minutes in absolute silence. Don't talk and avoid noise. Pay attention to how it feels. Do you get restless at any point? Relaxed? Which thoughts come to your mind? Earplugs are a great help in this exercise. This is a fantastic reset for your day. Number 5. Gratitude. You can do this exercise every night. Before going to sleep you go through the day and let arise what has moved you. The focus is on the beautiful experiences, that is on things, people and situations for which you feel gratitude. To anchor it even better, you can create a diary and write down the three things for which you were most grateful that day. The important thing is to connect with this feeling. Only when it remains in your perception for at least 20 seconds does it have a positive effect that can also be measured in the brain. And finally, number 6. Perceive your environment. This one is also perfect for the workspace. 
Do you have idle time at the office or a short break? Perfect for the next mindfulness exercise. And your colleagues will definitely not notice it either. Take a conscious look around your workplace. Which plants are in the office or which pictures are hanging on the walls? How tidy and untidy are the desks? The trick is to pay attention to the smallest details and take your time. You can also touch, feel and sense certain things. Spontaneous impulses are what count. Whatever comes to your mind at that moment, give it your full attention. The main thing is that you let go of everything else at that moment. This way you can better withstand pressure in business, become more creative and find solutions to problems faster. And that's it! Try these exercises on a regular basis and I guarantee that you will already notice a slight reduction of stress and feel better even after the first few times. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button to spread it to a broader audience and check out my guided box breathing video. Thank you for watching.